This 26 Sports and CCTV High School Volleyball presentation is brought to you by Cadillac Casting Incorporated. All right, we are back to the Cadillac Gymnasium for girls district semifinal action. Just about ready to get going here. Karen, can we get our sponsors mentioned here again real yeah, quick? Yeah, um, tonight our sponsors are Pizza Plus, High Point Cadillac, GMC, Cadillac Tire, Munson Healthcare, Cadillac Rehab Services, Bigelow Supply, Cadillac Casting, Great Lakes Energy and Wolverine Power Cooperative, and Summit Digital. Great, thank you so much for our sponsors. Yes, thank you. And I'm thinking that, trying to remember who served first last game, it looks like it's gonna be Reed City starting to serve. And Alyssa Olds will check in as the libero. And Rushford, who had a nice job there at the end of the game with her serving, that's Sydney. She'll start him off. Young is gonna put it out wide in a very nice swing. That was a nice attack from the freshman. I mean, she had a perfect approach and she hit it right down the line and found the open court. So Grace Fath with the, with the kill, now she gets to go back and serve. Not too shabby on the serve. Megan Borst, good swing. There's a tip over the net. Van Eck in the middle. I thought that might be a, a double hit there. Number 11 for Big Rapids, uh, that's Alexander Nowak. Tipped and on the line. Yeah. Was that Borst with the swing there, number yep. three? Yep, number three, Megan Borst. It is one to one here, early on in set number three. Big Rapids has taken the first two sets, so they're hoping they can finish this one out in three. Long serve up into the rafters. And a beautiful play by Grace White. Way to stay out of the net on that one, too. She just, uh, it's almost like she knew where it was at. On the defense, though, Karen, you've got to get up there just in case, right? I yes. mean, you got to challenge yep. that because they didn't, they, they backed off. Right. Number 13 is Emma Graves to Alyssa Ols er, Olds. Borst puts it in the middle. Young, fake to Owens. Seemed like she just missed hit that ball just a little bit to make it go into the net. Out She's of the had some trouble hitting into the net so far, um, but they were faking um, Grace White on it. Yeah. Jordan Stork with a good serve in the middle now. And Grace right White. Grace. Stork up to Borst. Here comes White again, this time from the other side, and that one is yes. going to go pinball into the rafters. She's hitting that slide back too and uh, so that's a hard one to cover when you're not prepared for it and that they're they do a great job of getting the ball to her and they move her around too yeah. to keep the defense off guard yep here's her jump serve and she misfires on that one toss was just a little bit off for her so three to three i'm sure she'll get her next one in <laughs> the reed city coyotes megan borst who is a senior for them Good serve to the back row. Perfect pass to Young. There's a shot by Cleaver. This time Rushford puts it, but dug up nicely. They're gonna go right back to Owens. She tips it over. Mora to Olds. Short set and puts it down. Yes. Oh, Michaela Cleaver on that one, the yeah. sophomore. That was a nice play. The, the blockers were there, but they weren't tight enough to the uh, net. Young. Rushford cross court, just a oh little yeah, bit long. That, was, that looked really close again. They've had a lot of close balls right there in that line, making the line judges be put to use tonight. I was looking at Coach Chelsea Nelson. She was calling that one out, hoping it was out. Yeah. Olds. Oh. oh a little miscommunication there. That's. That's uh, Jordan Stork's ball. Yep, and Madeline Mora knows it. Dakota Young for Big Rapids. There's a very good serve in the middle. Stork, sec now it's uh, Mora. Young this time to Grace Fath. 
push over the net. Back to Faf now. She swings and puts oh, it down. Nice. Way to be aggressive. Very impressive. That's going to be a timeout called by Coach Don Patterson for, um, excuse me, for Reed, Reed City. City. And boy, this game really, the momentum just swings back and forth. It forward. does. It, it is uh, actually fun to watch. You know, one team will have all the momentum and then it, they all side out, and the next team gets a, a little streak and. Just back and forth action. These these two teams know each other well. This will be the third time they played each other this year. Okay. Maybe another time or two in a tournament, but for sure in their two league games and now here in the districts. Uh, both of them struggled with their overall record this year. Big Rapids looks pretty solid, though. They do. You know, their approaches look great, and, um, you know, once uh, Dakota Young's doing a great job setting the ball and getting them to our hitters and mixing up the hits. Yes. And so it's making it tough for the Reed City defense to figure out which way to go and block them. So Dakota Young gets the serve going again. Stork out wide to Rushford. Rushford, that one was tipped at the net. Now here comes Owens. Owens with the big swing. Mora and Obermeyer were in the vicinity. We're going to give them both credit All right, for that. That sounds good. Who's checking in? Number four, that's Van Eck, Alexis Van Eck. Alyssa Olds with the left hand serve. Sets it back to Owens and a little bit long. Yep. Pretty good crowd here right now for Big Rapids and Reed City. Oh, there was miscommunication there. I don't know if it, the ball was in play, but. Was it uh, rotation something on the on the receive? Because it's obviously yeah, but it was as soon as um, it was as soon as the ball was served. So when they the whistle blew. So what do you think was happening? All I can think of is if um, they were out of rotation. Okay. But I didn't see if it was a replay or not. There's a a hit there by number four, Michaela Cleaver. It goes into the net. Seven to seven here in the third set. Usually what, what that will throw off a team a little bit when that kind of call is made. Back to Owens. Owens gets it over the net. Oh, oh. it's a double hit, yeah, by number four. Alexis, Alexis Van Nett, yeah. Yes. Um, but good job to Big Rapids for keeping that ball in play. Ayana Owens. I don't think any relation as far as you know to the year. Not to Owens. my family. Okay. As far as I know, yes. <laughs> There's a good jump serve, deep. This one has to go over, so Rushford puts it back to Owens. There's a hit into the net by Alexandra Nowak. She's a senior, number 11. She tried to take a little bit off of that one, but she was too far off the net, so that's why it didn't clear the net. She's a little bit closer. It would have been a nice roll shot over. Yep. Madeline Mora. Oh, that was, yes, look, look close again. They are making those line judges work tonight. Yes, Sharon Lucy with the good call. Nine to eight, Big Rapids. There's a shot that that one's too long, so they're trading uh, long serves. <laughs> That's right. That was uh, Grace Fath for Big Rapids. So now it's going to be Sydney Rushford. Yes. Good pass up to Young. She's looking for Fath. Stork to Borst. There's nice a block. By Fath, that yeah. one's going to be long. Oops, I shouldn't say anything. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think they can hear me. I was I was curious if she's going to play it. She was running back there like she's going to play it, but she let it go. Grace Fath. Megan Borst. Finds the middle, and she gets the point. Yes. Big opening in that defense in the middle there. Yep. Yeah, Reed City has been really good at finding those open, the open court tonight. 10 to 10. This time they go the other side on the serve. 
in the middle to Grace White, and she drills it down for the point. I had a feeling they were going to go to her that time. Yep, they needed a kill, and that's what they got from her. Isn't that funny how early on in, in the set one, but it, it seems like now she hasn't got too many hits. It's like right. it's, it, for some reason on the rotation. Well, a lot of it's a passing, too. If the pass is off, you want to go to your easiest hitter. So it's, that's not always your middle hitter. Obermeyer with the hit. White, this one has to go over, but right there was Megan oh. Borst. Dakota tried to pass that up, but just didn't get high enough. Good job by the senior, Megan Borst, just yes. to be all over that one. In comes Mora. And now yeah. Jordan Stork serving. They're going to go to White. Big swing, nice but it's blocked. Block. Good dig there by Olds. Borst tries to put yeah. it down, but Cleaver was there. Owens still live in and the middle to White. She pushes it back corner. Yep, she found the open court. Smart play by the senior. Now she's back row, so let's we'll see. And, um, and Dakota's up front setting, so they have the two hitters. So we'll... See we if they have a back row hitter or if it... She's been comfortable with the back row hit. No problem there. Yeah. Mora cross court, but that one's wide. So it's a two-point lead, 13 to 11 for Big Rapids here in the third set. Old, oh. good pass to Stork. She's just going to put over the net. Young out wide to Owens. Owens... Olds has it in the net, but good job by Obermeyer. That's a nice cover by Grace White, too. Pick up that second ball. There's a short set. Look at that athletic ability by Borst. Owens, good shot, but just a little long. A little too long, yep. 13 yeah. to 12, Big Rapids. Rushmore comes in for Reed City. Karen Owens, along with Bill Dooley, bringing you the action tonight from Cadillac. Hard serve, long. Yes, oh, that hurts. Long. <laughs> it hurts. It's, it it's so set number close. three. <laughs> Dakota Young, the setter, setter for Big Rapids, gets it over, and that was trouble chasing it down. It's not going to work. Oh, Megan Boris, yeah, she's she tried to bring it back in. She hustled for that ball. That serve is a tough one because it not sure if it was going to be in or out. Yeah. This time she goes to Borst. Good pass. Back to Mora. Off the hands of the block and down for the kill. Yeah, she had a nice tool off the block. Grace Fath tried to stay up in the air, but you can only you have <laughs> so much hang time. That's right. Some more than others. Yes. <laughs> Alyssa Olds, number 11, just gets it over the net. Big Rapids will have to take a back line shot. Here comes number four, Cleaver. Nice cover by Olds there. Back row Olds to White. Up. Now to Owens. Owens blocked. Still live. Oh. That's four hits. Good try. Nice block there by Mora. Yeah, Mora and Van Eck was there too, but Mora I think got the, the major portion of yeah. that one. Oh, in the net, a service fault, and it is 16 to 14, Big Rapids. Back into the game is number 11. That's Alexandra Nowak, the senior. And Owens back to serve. Yep, Ayana Owens, the junior. Good job on her jump serve. Yes. That was a tough one, yep. In the net was Mora. Mora. Couldn't tell if it was the ball or it must have been her follow through touch. Yeah, it. well, that set wasn't very high above the net, so it was just. Yeah. She had to do what she could to punch it over, and she hit the net at the same time. 17 14. This one's got to go over, so Boris gets it over barely. Young with the back row set to White. White took something off. Yep. Coming out of the back row like that, you need to hit it. So, Kira, that's the right idea though. She wanted to play it shorter. Yep, Kiara Barker into serve for the Coyotes. 
And also in is number 13, Emma Graves, the libero for the Cardinal. Nice job. That's Grace Faff again, the freshman. That was a smart play by her. She saw that, that they were hanging back, and she just tipped it right over the block. Her substitution. Yeah, Leah McGinnis is in to serve for Coyote, or the Cardinals, I'm sorry. McGinnis with a good serve. Van Eck. This time they're gonna set it to Faff on the other side. Good play by Borst. And now Rushford. Jordan Stork, a little bit long. Yes. She can't believe it. She had a nice <laughs> hit on it. She did. You've got to put so much top spin on those shots, too. Yeah. That one's out. So, so McGinnis. Uh, keeps the hopes alive for the Coyotes. It's 1916. Leah Seifert just came in uh, for the Cardinals. I think that's the first time we called her name. Yeah. Young, back to White. Ooh, a little bit too low. <laughs> 20 to 16 now for the Cardinal. Five more points, and they will advance to the. Championship game tomorrow. That's right. Olds to Stork to Borst. They get it up to White, and now Young's going to have to hit it over. Van Eck will be the setter to Stork. Not That's what they wanted. No. That's trouble. Grace White with the kill. And a timeout by Coach Don Patterson with the score 21 to 16 in set number three and the Cardinal are up by three. We can get our sponsors yeah, going. Yeah, our sponsors tonight are Summit Digital, Great Lakes Energy and Wolverine Power Cooperative, Cadillac Casting, Big Low Supply, Munson Healthcare Cadillac Rehab Services, Cadillac Tire, High Point Cadillac GMC, and Pizza Plus. So thank you to all of our sponsors. So Karen, uh, Coach Patterson, I mean, what are some of the things you can say right now? Just kind of calm down, or what would? Yep, um, New City's been really good at digging the ball and getting the ball in the court. So they, they don't hit too many out. That was a nice serve yeah. by by the Cardinals. And you could not place it any better right, than Grace Bath yes, did. Yes. And um, but yeah, just I, I'd say it's calm down, keep the ball in front of you, and you can do this. So. That is another good serve by Faf, the it freshman. Was. Stork puts it in the net. Oh, and so close to being over, too. Well, it is now 23 to 16 for Big Rapids. They keep it in with a good line shot serve. Borst overhits it. I was just saying how <laughs> they keep it in the court, but it's all right. If I was Jordan, I would set Boris again. Yep, come right back to her. Yep. Fath. Here comes Stork. She's going to go oh. this side, opposite side. And the tip does not work. And the Big Rapids Cardinal are going to advance to the district championship game tomorrow. Uh, we want to congratulate the Reed City Coyotes uh, for their spirited play tonight. But, uh, Karen, we're going to take a quick break. You are watching Girls High School Volleyball Action on 26 Sports and CCTV. And Karen and I will be right back for a post-game show in just a moment.